Four female politicians from Turkey's ruling Islamist AK party have worn their Islamic headscarves in Parliament. In a challenge to the country's secular tradition, the last time a lawmaker attempted to wear a headscarf in Parliament in 1999, she was expelled. While there were previously no specific restrictions on wearing the headscarf in Parliament, opposition from secularists as well as a ban in other state institutions, which was lifted recently, had previously deterred women from wearing them. The headscarf is an emotive symbol in Turkey, viewed by secularists as the emblem of political Islam. Its appearance in public life is seen as an affront to the Turkish Republic's secular roots, established by founding father Mustafa Kemal Atatürk. In September this year, another controversial law, which placed limits on the sale and advertising of alcohol in Turkey, was introduced despite widespread criticism. Shops are now banned from selling alcohol between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m., and also within 100 meters of a mosque or school. Turkey has been in a state of civil unrest since violent protests started in Istanbul in May this year. Although triggered by the violent removal of protesters from a park, the demonstrations developed into a widespread campaign against the Islamist government and the perceived erosion of basic rights, such as the freedom of the press and freedom of expression. An estimated 3.5 million Turks are now said to have taken part in protests across the country. Subsequent government-backed police brutality has contributed towards 11 people being killed, over 8,000 injured and at least 4,900 detained.